wonder if the things will pop up here. What's up? So, go ahead and give you the, the skinny. We kind of, I kind of like lease land. So like half of my land is like manicured, half isn't. Because the lease tenant only has the house here and they don't come by very often. So you see like shit like this. You can't really, it's hard to tell, but like, they're currently doing repairs on it. So like, they don't cut the grass very often. <laughs> what up, K-Mac time? What's up, player? So this is like my little boxing shit. Like this is my bag. Right over here. It's unlike Boogie's bag. This right here takes can take a pound in. Like it's it's a seventy pound bag. Where's Bongo? Bongo! Come on out, buddy. He's in his dog pen right now. Let me flip you guys around. Come on, Bongo. Who's a good puppy? Who the good puppy? Who the best puppy? Uh, May 13th, Eric. May 13th. That Bongo boy. Bongo has that dog pen, and we also have this converted into a dog pen. like this is my shed that's why i do that's why i do my boxing reps that's what I, this i do the water here i usually do 20 farmers walks usually this thing right here is a little further back but i recently had the the roof replaced i usually walk to that fence to somewhere in this general direction right here and i try to do 20 reps of those Going to the front of the house. That's my truck and my wife's car. This is my land too, but like I said, we're leasing it. So like, I don't like to get on their property since they're technically the owners right now under the lease. They have not done a good doing the di doing the dishes, <laughs> doing the yard. But it, to be fair, like my ditch ain't looking that great either. There's always a chance Boogie could knock me out. Always a chance. Like right here's where I used to. Oops. Right here's where I used to sit <laughs> when I did walking. The light bulbs in here. I think I change it once every five years. Is that the surgery truck? No. I just replaced the American flag. We got a brand new roof on the house. Hey, trumpet. What's up, Trumpet? Thank you for being six months, homie. I don't know how good it is. This, this used to be my cow back here. What do we got there? Is that a froggy? There's my old gutters. Some of them. Here's the other side of the thing. Bongo! 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 Come here, bud. Who's the biggest boy? Who's the bongo boy? Officer Bongo, come here. Bongo's part Rottweiler, part German Shepherd. So he's an odd looking dog. Yeah, I got neighbors. 
there's a if you look right there and to see just white that's a house too there's Kelly Hi, doll. hey beautiful What's happening? over here chilling showing the house off oh we had a donation can't wait to see you in the ring. Me either, dude. I'm excited for it. Mm-hmm. Pop this over. Why, why, why are we going there that way? Ain't, ain't she the most beautiful? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm, you smell. You smell so good. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not feeling very beautiful today. What's wrong, baby? Mm, just don't feel. Not feeling it. My hair's still not done. <laughs> she did get her hair done. <laughs> she just hadn't fixed it today. Like when she got up this morning, she looked like a greaser. Whatever. You know you loved it. You look like you look like you're from the movie Grease. You had like a, a pump what do they call it? A pompadour? Yeah, that was high, so, uh, yeah, I saw that. <laughs> At least I got that down a little bit. Yeah, you had you a cowlick. You just saw a raptor? Yeah. Hey, uh, do you want me to bring you your boxing gloves so you can show off your boxing? I mean, I mean, if you won't. Is it? I, I was planning on doing that, that video I talked about with Keem. Right. So I was going to do it that way. Yeah, I mean, think, like, if I stay on track, and I do everything right, I'll have, I'll be under 400 pounds by Monday. And it'll be the first time I'm under 400 pounds since like September of 2020. Well, I've dyed it, which we, Kelly did it. And it was the first time ever dyeing a man's beard. So like, and it also had a touch of gray, but it seemed like all the touch of gray standing right where. If I hit 10 without getting gassed, that depends on what you consider a gas. Like, I'm a big dude. Take a big dump. Show the secret surgery raptor again. I mean, I don't really have a raptor. This is what I got. This is my shit. 2018 Silverado Z71 with the old man tires. I could walk for two hours right now. I mean, am I going to breathe heavy? Sure. But it's not about breathing heavy. Breathing heavy just means your body wants more oxygen. Like, I'm not physically tired. I'm not, like, hyperventilating or anything like that. Austin! Damn, that shit went quick. Look. Looking good, Wings. Did you hear? I don't know what that word is. But no, I didn't hear. The Raptor, you just put a Chevy logo on it. Nah, I've always been a GM guy for the most part. I like the Raptor though. Go ahead, educate you, children. Hey, Wings, this is Boogie's coach. Any advice on how to stop him from sh sh shaking anytime we bring up the fight? He might be having like an insulin deficiency. Give him Mountain Dew. Make sure you put it in a baby bottle. See, this is a Z71 wheel, right? You, you like look at it, it's like, oh, look, they just filled in the regular wheel with like extra thing. But th this is the reason it's like this. The reason it's like this is say you hit a stump or something right here, it's double reinforced, right? So this is extra strong. If it was a spoke, it wouldn't be as strong. But Oski, he needs a new toy. I got you, buddy. Can I do a 30 second fast run? You probably wouldn't be able to tell. No, these are 18s. Let's see. Made in the USA. 
like all fine Michelin products, because you know your boy will only rock fuck with that Michelin. <laughs> Stuck the Chevy Lock on the thing, too. Let's see, where can I set you guys up? How about this? I'm gonna sit you guys down. I'm gonna run to the road and run back. There we go. Dude, that's not, I'm not fast at all. <laughs> I tried to do it safely though. I'm trying to concentrate on breathing while doing exercise because I kind of hold my breath sometimes. <sighs> Thank you, Rez. Oh. <laughs> oh. I gotta film a video for Keemstar. <laughs> Promote the fight. I'm not fast at all. <sighs> I'm sorry. Give me a second. Hoosier, you still coming by, man? Thank you, Mike. Thank you so much. Oh, we only got 350 now? I thought we had almost 500 <laughs> earlier. Oh. Hey, what I want you guys to do, go to Boogie Stream Tuesday, ask him to do the same thing. You know what I'm talking about? Don't bongo put my ass in a race. Woo! All right. Get my wind back. Yeah, I've been getting a lot of fucking sun lately. <laughs> It's not really a workout stream. <laughs> Speaking of trolls. Just show off. If you look right, right up above here. I have like 12 fucking cameras on the outside. And they're all motion sensed, censored. So I know who's at my house at all times because people be threatening to shoot me and shit over nothing.
Nah, I don't have any guns. Like I sold all my guns the first time I got swatted. Be perfectly honest. I felt they were too big of a liability with all that shit hanging around. You know. I gotta go get booster done for uh, the trip to England. Cause I don't know if you gotta have COVID-19 cards still, but I'm taking mine regardless. Hey Graham, thank you for the five pounds, man. We don't need them. No. Not mad at the red coats at all. That run's still fucking with me. Oh. <laughs> Touch grass more often. Dude, I love being outside. I just live in a world where it seems like every time I come outside, something bad happens. Yeah, over there. Let me flip it over for you. Like over there, where the house sits, I wanted to build a shop. But, you know, shit happens. Like I wanted to build like a three garage, three garage shop with a like a lift in it. I had it planned out and everything. It'd be like twenty thousand dollars. Yeah, I love my property. Like you should see it when it's actually cleaned up. Like I still haven't raked it yet. Like I told myself I was going to rake it before the fight, as part of like conditioning. Because, like, I was fucked up. Like, when Keemstar first approached me, I was afraid to accept it. Rake it. R-A-K-E. Rake. Um, <clears throat> but I was fucked up. Like, I was... Like, you seen that run I did? I know it's fucking sad and people make fun of it and shit, but, like... When I started this shit in March, like second week of March, I couldn't have walked to the mailbox and back without fucking being like destroyed. Like this isn't destroyed what I'm talking about, but destroyed is like wiped out. I need to go lay down. Like I've put on, I've dropped 25 pounds. I've put on a good sec section of muscle. My stamina still fucking sucks though. I still think it's better than boogies. But it still sucks. I don't want to be better in boogie. I want to be better than another dude. Like if I, I'm always, I try to set my bar a tier higher than I actually need it to be. I mean, like this, like even accepting this fight was probably one of the best choices I made in the last couple of years. And I say a couple years because I got married 2020. Like, Kelly is the best choice I've ever made in my life. I don't know why I was skipping on it because, like, Kelly was smitten with me for years. But I was afraid. I was afraid to bring somebody into the life that I lead. Especially after 2017. And I didn't think me and Kelly would match because of, you know, atheism versus, you know, devout Christian. Oh, me and Kelly do walk. We usually go all these squirrel feeders and everything, and it's right next to the PD River. 
so you can walk right alongside the PD River and there's a big uh, there's a big boardwalk there there's like benches and water fountains it's so nice it's like a like it's like half a mile in diameter but you can just walk it over and over and over again uh, we can't take bongo for a walk right now bongo just had um quick uh quick kill treatment and he tested clean but we got to wait six months on the uh, heartworm medicine before we're allowed to take him to like the dog park or anything Yeah, South Carolina. Like, honestly, I, I wouldn't want to live any other place in the world. Like, to me, like, the smell of, like, azalea bushes and the feeling of humidity, to me, that, that's home. You gotta looking at this. This right here is a gopher. You gotta find his ass. Let me put my water lines up. Hey Stein, thank you, dude. <laughs> gopher versus Jordy. People wanted to see Bongo again. I'm hoping I'll fight again. Like, it's been a positive experience. Bongo! Where you at, buddy? I bet he's in his doghouse again. Bongo! We'll go find him. He is Bongo, buddy. Ugh. Let's sit down and play. <laughs> Chris, thank you for the five dollars, homie. Yeah, we put him inside when the weather's bad. Or when he has to eat and stuff. He's a good pups. He's a good pups. Those are good pups. <laughs> oh, yes, yes, you are. Yes, you are. Say hi. Yeah, it's gonna rain out here again. It's rained all morning. Mm. All right, don't tear my shirt, buddy. Dog, you weigh like 110 pounds. This, this right here ain't hurting. Homeboy's got his foot lodged deep into my coin. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be a clean kick KO. What I think I'm gonna happen is I'm gonna stun Boogie. And when I stun him, I'm gonna have to go in for the kill. And I think I'm gonna take him out with a right hook. No, it's not wet, wet. But I gotta, I gotta come out here and do my boxing shit later anyway, so I might have to take a bath and a shower. So it doesn't really matter. Uh, May 13th, May 13th, we're going to be the fourth fight of the preliminaries. Oh.
I'll get paid all right. I mean, like, I wish I made more money, but like, I really took it more for the experience than the money. Like, something to motivate me, try to get me out that fucking funk I was in. I don't know how hot it is. I would say 82, just from like guessing. It's not that bad. Dude, Tyson Fury would put me in a coffin. <laughs> well, I can tell you right now, I'm, I'm making peanuts. But I had to do like an MR I had to do like an open area MRI. I was like four hundred and eighty-eight dollars. Had to do an OTC scan. I was like a hundred something. Had two doctor visits. You know, I've got I've got about eighteen hundred dollars wrapped up into the trip already. I have two thousand when everything's said and done, not including like stuff we're gonna do in England. That's what I'm focused on, John. I'm trying to be entertaining. Looking at it as a stepping stone. Oh, OCT. It's uh, for your eyes. Like you sit, you look in this machine, and there's like this little cross. There's like these red lasers that go up and down, and you got to follow it with your eye. But I figured if I get it all done now, it's all good for a year. So the next boxing event, all profit. So when I go ahead and knock out Nikocado Avocado or Dark Side Phil, it's all, the money's going to be on the house. Be, no, I haven't. I don't really watch Steven Crowder. What do I think DSP weighs? I think DSP is probably like 210, maybe. 200, 210. My current weight, 404 pounds. I did a, I did a stream, I, I weighed myself this morning. I weighed, two weeks ago I weighed 426. So I'm hope I got two weeks till before the fight. I'm hoping to lose another. If I lose another 25 pounds, I'd be excellent. That put me right where I want to be at. I want I want to want to go in the fight at 380. Oh, I'm hoping to be 300 by years in. Like if everything in my mind goes right and I stay on this track, I'm hoping to be 300 by Christmas. But it all depends if I can stay on Ozempic or not because Ozempic's a fucking lifesaver. If anybody's out there wondering if they should get on like Ozempic, the shit's the bomb. I'd say so, I would say Ozempic's almost better than weight loss surgery. I need to get some free weights. <laughs> it's not a rev, it's a stock V8, man. 
And if I turn it on, the Bluetooth's gonna connect to the truck and it's gonna drop the stream. Yeah, I'm on Zempic right now. I can do well more than two jumping jacks. I don't want to do high intensity stuff. I don't want to risk an injury. My long term goal is 330. That's my long term goal. That's where I want to be at 330 pounds. I don't have any water right behind me. My issue is I'm eating so little that um, my body's having trouble making saliva. I don't have a Mustang. I have a Silverado. My wife has a Blazer. Kelly from the office. The rims of the silver auto have is a defect. Well, I haven't had no issue with them. And there's about a about a hundred thousand trucks in this area with these same rims. Belma from like Scooby Doo. Bailey. Oh. Come on, Bailey girl. You smell bongo me, don't you? You're like, you cheating bitch. Shit, fucking can you who's a fire. Yeah, it's a little messy right now. Um, I've already fixed the, all the stuff for the house. Like, all the major things in the house have been fixed. Except your wife. She's still horrible. Kelly thinks she needs money to get fixed. I do. But, um, I fixed most of that. I don't own any firearms. No, because, like, there's too many people that follow me that will just, you know, get me thrown out of places and shit like that. I'm not about that. Bailey. My little mop. I, I can't have kids. I've got low T. Oh, King Cobra says he's going to take Kelly from me. Kelly, you think you date King Cobra? Oh, heck no. Mm. The roach is on the wall? No. No. He'd he make you food. He Where's DoorDash? <laughs> oh.
You want to see the fridge? cheese to fill down there. Speaking of water, I think we get some more. Hmm? I know there is. Where's the Pepsi fridge? Uh, I use the 2% milk to make my protein shakes. What's up, Smoke Break? I stole his Mountain Dew. I, I have that just because I want to taste. Like, I'm addicted to soda, but I'm trying to keep it out the house. But, like, I'll give myself a taste every now and then. I'll pour a little bit in a glass. Dog, I'm not trying to fucking drink shit. I want, like, I want to enjoy my fucking protein shake because it's about all I eat. This motherfucker's, like, use water instead of milk. That shit tastes nasty. Are you talking about those Pepsis King came here and got? The King brought those shits. You guys act like I'm like 185 pounds trying to cut down to 175. That I should watch the sugar content in my ketchup bottle. <laughs> Bailey's waiting on the world to change. Grayson. I need kitty love. See you, Dragon. Thank you again for the $500, man. Where's Gray? Great son. Bailey, go find Grayson. Yeah. Please show that they're terlet. I don't know what that means. Uh, Drew, dude, it's been about a year and a half. I don't want to show the toilet. I don't know. I don't know. See, like, my issue with the toilet is I don't have, I have weight loss surgery. So, like, I don't have solid stool. So, like, I don't know what the back of the bowl looks like right now. Oh, I think he's asking for the toilet. I am 37. Dog, I got a chair for $5.
Hey, Billy Mays. Welcome back from the dead, bud. Uh, Ubisoft messed my rainbow account up. I don't want to, I don't, I don't like discussing Kelly's work <clears throat> I, because of internal life and stuff like that. Yeah, Kelly's going with me to London. Yeah, Kelly's job is spending money. She likes to do that. She's going to spend some money tomorrow night. Hey, it's tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, so you should be home by tomorrow night. Oh, so the money will be dead by tomorrow night. Yeah, yeah. By tomorrow night, you'll be telling me how you know we're. Should be on the budget. Why am I using all the money from London? You know, all that good stuff. See, I tell Kelly each month how much our budget is, and it just goes one in ear out the other. Because in my head, that's how much I have to spend is the whole budget, whatever's in the account. Well, the, yeah, I go, this is our budget. This needs to last us the whole month. And then times it by four. Times it by four, yeah. How long have you been married to me? You should know this by now. We're about to be in three years. Right? So hopefully we can celebrate this anniversary with a victory over Boogie. Boogie thinks you're still going to back out. What do you think about that? Dude, I wanted something witty. <laughs> in my head, I was like, I mean, I, in my head, I was going to say Boogie has a better chance of backing out of the booth at the local Apple, Applebee's because he gets stuck, but that joke wouldn't have landed. That is kind of funny, though. What? It's kind of funny. Boogie is training 10 minutes a day. 10 fucking minutes? Yeah. God damn, son. I better step my game up. I know. It's like, what, five more minutes than you? You better get it going. Yeah. You should have them inbox me questions so that we have material for your... Uh... Video? Yeah. Yeah. Questions about the fight? Questions about anything. And then I'll decide which ones get asked. <laughs> Kelly wants you guys to ask her questions about our life in her inbox on Twitter. I got married at 388. I was 388 when I got married. Do you remember, and this is such a fat people thing to do, the day we got married, we weighed to see how much we weighed the day we got married? Mm hmm You think skinny people do that? Maybe the day we got married, we literally came home and went to bed. And went to bed. <laughs> Nobody does that. No, we did go see Grandma. Did yeah. we go see Grandma? Grandma yeah, was we... at the wedding. We I was to... talking about... We went to my mama's house because I got something on the uh, on the suit. And you got mad at me because I took it to my mama instead of let you do it. Yeah, because... Well, because there comes a time where your wife is supposed to replace your mother. In a lot of ways. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, if we take one of our cars, I found out how much, um... How much is it? 60. For the whole... Whole time. Because to me, it's worth it. Yeah. We'll just take... We'll take your car. Yeah. We'll take your car. And then we'll just drop my car off somewhere. Yeah. Take the Raptor. It's a little small. Just a tiny bit small. Who's watching the pets while we're going? We're going to board the cats and we're taking the dogs to grandma. Mm -hmm. No, we're, we're talking about the airport. Like, for parking and stuff. It's a, it's, it's like 60 bucks for overnight parking until we get back. Honestly, that's cheaper than someone doing gas. Yeah. To come on and get us and take us, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. 
To me, I think that's a fair. I might go ahead and vote that. Yeah, we probably should. They don't know what airport we're flying out of. I'm not telling you what airport. No, we're not getting first class. We're getting economy. What's up, Blackout? I had fatigue, a very bad cough, and a constant throbbing headache. And then like about four or five days into it, I, I got bad sin, sinus drainage, like to the point I couldn't sleep or breathe half the time because it was always snot in the back of my throat. Spirit doesn't do overseas, man. I got you, Corza. I got you. Smug. I don't feel like I look smug. I pre dude, Blackout, thank I appreciate you, dude. Thank you so much for all the donations. Well you have to wait till see if I win the fight. I mean, me fighting somebody else depends if I win this fight or not. Right now, I'm taking it one day at a time. I'm trying to stay hydrated. Trying to get not, not get malnourished. Trying to get my fucking workouts in. No, I'll never go pro. No, the fight that never rematch clause in it. No rematch clause in the, in the contract. I'm waiting on the world to change. You know, I still haven't got my damn kitty love yet. <laughs> Drop the freestyle. Bailey boop boop boo doo doo boo doo Bailey boop It's your girl Bailey harder than the rest harder than a dude doing an arithmetic test It's Bailey girl hard to the core Big Bailey won't give you no more She's a big bad gun toting puppy Motherfuckers out here getting lucky That she ain't mad That she ain't clip She pop up with the Glock and give a motherfucker split it's your girl Bailey, Bailey Boo. It's your girl Bailey, Bailey Boo. <laughs> this is what Kelly hates. Kelly hates when I sing Bailey songs. Look at this face. Zeus, thank you for the 11 months, homeboy. You see that bear right there? 
as Bailey's victim every day. Uh, KO means you physically knock them out, like they went down for the tank out. Technical knockout is the referee stops the fight, or there's an, a lot of an amount of falls that a person can take in the round. No, I didn't see Taylor got divorced. Didn't his wife have like a thing? Hey, it's Rocco. Hey, it's Big Rock. All right, boys. I'm probably gonna call it right there. Thanks everybody for coming out. Thank you, Dragon, for the 500. Thank you, Dominic, for the 100. Thanks everybody who threw a donation my way. There was tons of donations today. I hope everybody had a wonderful time. I'll see you guys later. Peace, people.